Well, hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Life of Wonders. I'm very happy to be sharing with you this series of reviews I will be making of all the uh, Sizzle Skill um, art dolls that are part of my collection. I just think that they're all incredible and they're like treasure pieces and I very much hope that you can appreciate them and, and that you like them all too. So I will start uh, this review series with uh, Karin, which is the first doll uh, that we have in front of us here. She's just a darling girl. Um, she's representing, well, she's about 25 inches tall or so with no clothes. So like fully clothed and everything, these dolls can actually reach up to 28, seven inches or so. Um, and she's a standing doll. Um, that represent uh, like a toddler, I would say. Yeah, toddler age, more or less. And uh, she's got this really stunning face um, with an open mouth. Uh, she's smiling to us <laughs> and she has the, the loveliest eyes um, in clear blue color. They're made of uh, German glass eyes and then she's hand painted uh, well all these dolls are hand painted by the team uh, that were working uh, with Cecil skill uh, but these are not reborns as such um, I have collected them uh, with the idea in mind that I might uh, be able with time because I'm, I'm still like you know getting my way with acrylics and all that uh, reborn them that is like trying to get all the paint that's already in them off and then repaint them like in the most realistic possible way and um i just can't wait to do that like i've already done i mean with with all of that uh i've already um done that with a couple of them that i sold in the past and and I will continue as I have time for it. But right now I will be sharing this this cults with you. And again, very much hope you like them. So this is Karen, and and again, as I said, she has like a super cute um, face and looking her eyes that is incredibly amazing. She's got two braids that I uh, put together because she's actually got more hair on the back uh, that's not braided uh, because she has tons of hair um, she's got a, a natural hair uh, human hair wig so it's it's all natural and and then I think that the painting is actually really good um, in this case I mean these dolls can be really uh, very old at times and so uh, you never know what to expect because sometimes the paint has faded away but in this case it's very well preserved and I like I like it very much and she's still wearing her original tags in place she's wearing this um, I would say three pieces outfit very uh, traditional sort of like um, Scottish theme outfit um, in which you can you can find this this cute super cute hat um, here and then she has this petticoat uh, sort of jacket um, and then this inner dress that's like red and then it has a little bit of the tartan um, signature in there and then I believe yeah she's got this under garments um, in red color as well and then um, the leggings are in I would say is it black yeah it's black and then this leather um, brown shoes that are really I mean this is yeah this is um, actual leather and um, and they're really cute and in excellent excellent condition so I love her very much. Uh, I love her to pieces. It's one of my favorite. Uh, although all of them are my favorite, you will you will see how much I appreciate them all. But this one is incredibly cute. Um, I really can't wait to try to reborn her when I have again like enough time to do it absolutely uh, well. 
I mean that is properly uh, but for now I really hope that you've enjoyed her she's um, she's holding her safe <laughs> teddy bear here um, so I really hope you've enjoyed it and appreciated her details I'll make this close up let's see if it focuses yeah just please forgive the the um, background noise that um, there is construction going out outside right now so um, I can't do anything about it but but I hope it doesn't disturb you a lot um, and I'm trying to raise my voice as well so you can you can listen to me she's she's got this um, shade of like ashy blonde color that really suits her brows and eyes very much and then that's her smile up close this is really 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 cute and then she has this um, left hand and the other one here they were produced by goats these dolls in Germany and and everything that she's wearing right now is produced by by the same company but obviously I have also uh, over the years I've bought um, clothes that would fit them and and she can wear other incredible dresses that are that I might be able to share with you in the future if you like her so for now I hope you like this video and you can stick um, and stay tuned for the rest as I will be reviewing all of them and Karina is saying bye bye to all of you right now. Bye.